Hey guys, I wanted to talk about two things real quick uh, for the next, uh, for the Twilight episode. One being the timing of the episode, and the second being the progress. Now, the timing of the episode is apparently a massive coincidence just because it's the 10 year anniversary of uh, Twilight coming up. And to celebrate, uh, Stephanie Meyer is releasing a gender swapped version of the original story. So, I mean, that'll take her all of. 20 seconds to switch. All she has to do is go in, switch uh, Bella's name to Bo, I think it was, and Edwards to Edith. I think that's what she won with. So, I mean, both the characters will sound like they were born in the 1910s. That'll get a modern audience's attention. So all she has to do is go into a Word document, uh, go to the replace word function, and boom. Entirely new story. So I guess now the girl is the creepy stalker, and the boy is the boring as shit, do nothing character. Yeah, that's that's exactly what people want to read. But I mean, I'm not surprised that this happens. I mean, we we acknowledge national tragedies. We uh, have a mode of silence every year for 9/11. We remember Pearl Harbor, things like that. So I mean, it's it's totally expected that something like this would happen. That we would uh, acknowledge when this occurred. So that's a whole thing. Not sure if I'm going to be able to work that into the episode or not, but. We'll see. I, I haven't even started scripting, and that leads me into the progress of the episode. Now, my method when I create an episode is I watch the movie, and then I read the book, and that eliminates the possibility of some of the possibility of bias. And then I write the script and edit and do all that stuff. Well, that's where I'm getting hung up, because book's going a little slower than normal. Now, I am by no means a slow reader. I read Dune in less than, in like, three weeks. That's an 800-page book. Uh, this one is 500. I'm on page 179 right now, chapter 9. I've been reading this for almost a month. This is so god-awful, it's not even funny. Part of it is just because of the copious amount of notes I'm taking, but... Good God, this is so hard to struggle through. So, um, in combination of that and some of the extra filming I'm inevitably going to do, um, and the scripting, this episode is going to take me a while, so I just wanted to give you guys a heads up. Probably not going to be out until sometime in, uh, maybe late November. Um, that's, that's purely a guess at this point. I'm working through this as fast as I can, but... I swear, some, sometimes I'll sit down and read this, and I'll go six or seven pages, and then I just pass right out. It's... This is so god-awful. There is so little to this. Um, it, it's borderline offensive to me. Uh, shit. So I'm going to keep struggling through that. I'm going to... Uh, I am eventually going to finish it. Um, I've been able to make more progress lately. Um, part of the other problem is I had to take this entire week off of, from working on the show just because it's the end of the fiscal year. I have a lot of paperwork to do for, uh, for some of my employees at work just because I have to get uh, end of the year evaluations done for them. Uh, so that's, that's taken a lot of time away from the show. Uh, with luck, I'll be done with that by the middle of next week. Should be able to put all my free time back into the show, so we'll see. With luck, I'll begin scripting by next weekend. That's, uh, that's the goal right now. But as anyone who pays attention to my updates knows, I am terrible at deadlines, so we'll see. So that's all I really had to say. I hope you guys are reading something better than I am, and uh, I'll see you in the next video.